In today's After Effects tutorial, I'll be showing you how to animate between different fonts or different font variations. So for example, I've got my text layer here with the Helvetica font, and I'm gonna duplicate it and select a different font completely just for the sake of the tutorial. So let's go with this one and I'll select a different color so you can see the difference. Okay, so we're gonna be animating between the two. Now, the way we do this is we select the layer, create, and create shapes from mask. We'll do the same for the second one. And we can get rid of the text layers because we don't need them anymore. I'll go into my search tab here and search for path. Then we've got the paths of both text layers in the shape layers. And we'll just click the stopwatches here and we'll copy the keyframe from one of them onto the other. So we select the path here and paste it. Let's hide this layer, and just like that, you can see we got a pretty messy animation. So the way we fix this is let's go and delete this layer because we don't need it anymore. And I'll select our path, go to my first keyframe here. So let's select this path, for example, here. I'll right click it, mask and shape, and set first vertex. Then we'll do the same thing on the other keyframe. So we'll select this one and do the same exact thing. So now, you can see that we smoothed things out and we have it animating between different fonts. Now, if we select the keyframes, let's hit F9, go into my graph here and just speed things up a bit at the beginning, like so. Turn on motion blur as well and then play this back. You can see that we get a rather smooth animation here. It's a bit rugged on the edges, but we are animating between different fonts. Now animating the same thing with a text layer is going to be pretty much the same, but let me show you a quick trick to save you some time. So in this case, I'm gonna be selecting from semi-bold font. Let's duplicate it and I'll make one just light. Let's change the color so you can see the difference and we're gonna have it animate between the two. So again, the same thing, we're gonna select our text, create and shapes from text. And I'll do the same thing on this one Let's get rid of these layers. We'll search for path and we'll just scroll down here holding the mouse one so we can create a bunch of keyframes for all our paths. Now, let's select the layers, hit U to bring up only the keyframes and instead of just copying these one by one, what you're gonna do is select the keyframes and then we have to go, let's say about here and we have to select the path in the correct order. So holding down shift, I'm just gonna go down here. Unfortunately, you cannot just select the last one and that will select all of them like you would think. So we're just gonna select them in the right order and paste the keyframes. So we've pasted the keyframes for the first shape to the second one. Let's disable this one so we can see the animation. And as you can see, we are shifting between two variations of the same font and it's looking rather smoothly. So a quick tutorial on this technique. I hope you found it useful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.